Hey, what's going on everyone? Appreciate y'all coming here and checking out this Starfield video. In this one, we're going to be checking out the different developer rooms that are in the game. Hope you all find this enjoyable. The first one we're going to be checking out requires the console command Q-A-S-M-O-K-E. You may be familiar with this one from Fallout. Let's go ahead and type that in. Oops, got to put C-O-C first. Q-A-S-M-O-K-E. There we go. All right, here we are. Oh my gosh, behind me is Vasco. I think he just came with me, actually. Captain, protocol indigo yeah, is cool. in effect. Fun fact, um, in case you don't know, there are certain names that Vasco will actually say to you. He won't just call you Captain if you actually name your character like Alex or something like that. He'll actually say Alex instead of Captain. Pretty cool. But yeah... This is the first developer room. We got some things on each side, it looks like. Let's go over here. What's inside this? Okay. Some ammunition and a couple different weapons. Not much, though. So this is the modified pistol that I got. Let's go ahead and fire it. Does it look or sound any different? Oh, nice. You gotta love the way firing the weapon sounds in this game. It sounds so crisp. Alright, um, check out this one now. Whoa! It's like a rainbow in here. I guess that's kind of normal. Oh no, that looks, that looks pretty cool. Uh, let's see. It's pretty normal, though. Grenade! Oh. Alright. Let's see. What's over in this corner? Tess animated particle burst. if I stand on it. Nothing. Let's see, what's over here? Alright. That's about it. Actually, before I exit out of this one, let's turn off collision. What's underneath us? Anything? No. You never know. Okay. Anyways, I haven't checked out this object that's in the middle. Can you interact with it or anything? Nope. Alrighty. Anywho, now let's go to the next developer room. This is the Q-A-S-M-O-K-E one. Well, you have to type in C-O-C first. Space, Q-A-S-M-O-K-E. Okay, anyways, this next one is going to be a little different. This next one that I know of is COC Vincent Test Cell. Alright. Okay, this one right off the bat looks way cooler. Oh my. Look at all these random pictures. Pretty cool. I'm sure there's a few references on these pictures too that you may be familiar with. Wait, what's this? Hmm. Neat. Just a random volleyball net right here. Cryo chamber, it looks like, or some bed to sleep in. What is this like a shower? Old earth plate, okay. Desktop sand garden. 
sand garden tool. Before I carry on with this tour, I just want to check real quick the outside of this place. Just in case I forget after the tour. Let's see, anything unusual? Oh, what the? Wait, what the? Oh, whoa, whoa, what's going on here? Okay. So, there are some things outside of this place that we can check out. Alright. This is cool. Can I, like, loot these drawers? No? Alright. Whole lot of nothing in here. What's this? Yeah, whole lot of nothing. That's the major developer room over there. Anyways, what's over here? Whoops. Super dark. Whole lot of nothing once again, just different couches. Anything on top? Pretty cool though, nonetheless. I definitely would have missed this if I didn't turn collision off. Anywho, I'm curious, what are these giant black buildings? Can I go in them? Yeah, you can, I mean, of course I can go in them, I got collision off, but, okay, they're just giant destroyed buildings. Random. Don't know what that's all about. So I'm pretty sure that's all of the different cells in this area, yeah. Now, I remember seeing something underneath this, too, when I first went out. What are these? Eh. Nothing I can't loot. What about over here? Anything? Over here, there's just some miscellaneous items, which I'm pretty sure these are in the regular test room where all the goodies are at. Pretty sure I remember seeing a lot of these. Anyways, let's carry on. Let's go back to the room where a lot of the goodies are at. We're back. Let's carry on. Oh my gosh, just a whole bunch of random stuff. Of course, this is a developer test area. I'm not seeing any weapons, though. But a bunch of random stuff here. Pretty cool how your companion comes with you as well to this place. Captain. Whoops, I'll didn't mean you. to do that. Sorry, bud. Nuclear fuel rod. Drilling rig. Hmm. Alright. I guess this must have been like the test room to test out. Oh! bunch of random miscellaneous items and whatnot, but look at this. Assassin's Refined. I am. Alright, let's check that out. Alright. Dang! 
<laughs> so cool. Exterior damaged. I had to do it. Exterior plating damaged. I'm kind of curious. What happens if I keep? Flawless health compromised. Enemy damage received. Warning: damage received. All right. What are these? These look like turrets or something. Pretty cool. Benjamin Bayou figurine. Oh, okay. It's a figurine of that statue. What's that? Gold pyramid sculpture. Planetary system sculpture. Astral lounge special. Sandria. Okay. Bunch of drinks. What else we got here? Can I interact with this? Chair. Let's see. Anything interesting? That happens? No. I could play musical chairs though. La di da. Oh, what the? I chose to sit down in that chair. Bunch of different chairs are right here. Oh, boxes of different goodies. Got some onions, oranges, pears, plums, grapes, celery, carrots. Wow, tons of drink packs and meal packs. That's cool. This is like pretty. A lot of the different food that you can get in the game and drinks alien energy drink did I just see that I think I did aha powerful beverage made from alien extracts infused with caffeine a favorite among space truckers <laughs> for the long drive to stay awake eh boom pop orange cola they got all kinds of different flavors for the boom pops Wow, alien stew, a thick stew made from various alien meats and vegetables. Crispy alien nuggets. <laughs> Surprised I've not seen a sweet roll anywhere. Kind of looks like, oh no, man, it looks like a sandwich. Yeah, that is a sandwich. A sandwich that combines corn to beef, cheese, sauerkraut, and other ingredients. Typically served on rye bread. Where's the sweet rolls? <laughs> Dang, this is valued pretty high. Almost 2500 for that. Oh, looks like this is where the sweet rolls would be. Nope. <laughs> Moonshine. Oh, a bunch of different plushies over there, too. That's cool. I'll check those out here in a sec. So much different decorations. Okay. Bunch of pill bottles. Oh, it's that one. It's those crazy artifacts over there. You know, the artifact that started it all. We'll start our adventure. Picked up one of those crazy ones, and then BAM! Our adventure started. Alright. Antique toy motorcycle. Plushy Gallic Cat. My friend will be. Varun Heretic Writings? What? That's valued really high. You picked up a contraband item. These are illegal to have on you or your, in your ship. 
Security ships orbiting major settlements will scan your ship for contraband and will not let you land until the scan is complete. You have a chance of smuggling contraband past them. If you fail, you could be arrested and have your contraband confiscated. Wow. I gotta say, I have not discovered these yet in the game. Toy space shuttle. Bunch of different strange alien plushies. That has to be fun for the developers to create aliens because, you know, you can just design them however you really like. We don't really, you know, have an exact identity of what an alien looks like besides just the common big-eyed, big-head one. But the other aliens and alien animals and whatnot, you can just, you know, let your imagination run wild creating them. Alright, bunch of the different artifacts. I'm surprised these are valued so low, like zero value? Wow. Huh, bunch of different tools. Cool. Bunk bed. This is a wild looking rug. Is that more of those? Nope, never mind. Alright. <laughs> oh, I didn't notice these. Alright, so yeah, there you have it. That's a tour over the developer rooms that I know about. Hope you all enjoyed this little tour over them. And yeah help break your curiosity over what's inside them. Unfortunately, there's no like crazy weapons you can loot from these developer rooms. There's probably some other ones out there that I'm just not familiar with at the moment, but this is a couple of them that I do know about. But yeah, hopefully you found these little tours enjoyable. I'm out of here though, everyone. As always, thanks for taking the time, watching, and listening. Until next time, peace.